inhabited. Welcome back to Luigi's Mansion. I am Ashtar Alchemist. This is Let's Plays, and this is Luigi's Mansion episode 13? 13, I, th I think it's 13. Not too sure. But anyway, up the stairs we go. Woohoo! And I haven't recorded for about a fortnight. So, uh, kind of don't remember what I'm doing. And, uh, kind of don't remember what I've done. So, woo! This is going to go so well. But I do remember that we have to go to the greatest room ever imaginable. That's right, guys. It is. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Oh, come on. Yeah, we go. The Astral Hall, yes! It's my room, yeah. And look, 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 look. Even has, look, even has a transmutation circle on the floor. Ah. See, what kind of alchemist does not have a transmutation circle? And that is why my logo, which um is, you see on my YouTube channel, my Twitter, my Facebook, and my Ask FM, and everything else, has a transmutation circle around it. I think it's a brilliant idea. And see, Luigi loves transmutation circles so much he's walking around in circles. I'm probably getting really annoying. And I've just realised something. Okay, do you guys notice anything different? This time, I came with fire! Okay, uh, I may not be a very good alchemist. I was about to say astral alchemist, which is technically true, but I may not be a very good alchemist at the moment, but if only I'm the novice, I'll get better. Just, just hold on, okay? Right, this is what you do. First of all, you check everything, because you never know, but I'd have money. Money? Oh, let's see, see? This is exactly why you check things. I mean, look at that. I mean, look at all this money, lovely, lovely money I get. And let's check this drawer here. Any money? Oh my god, more money. Yes. I want all the money. I want all of it. All of it's mine, all mine. Dun -dun. Oh, come on, I had a hundred already. So I went round before the episode started, getting all my life, because I started at like 39. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's burn all the candles. Let's burn them all. I don't know what I'm trying to sing. I'll set fire to everything. This isn't a song, but I've decided to make it up anyway. Oh, here we go. Oh, you interrupted me, you douchebags. Now, if this was Harry Potter, the purple flames mean that you can leave. Bye-bye. So, I'm going to go now. Oh yeah, something I've got to show. Dang it. Uh, actually, I'll, so, I'll show that a bit later, possibly, if I can. If I can't, sorry, I'll explain at the end. Oh, shy Guy Ghost, here we come. And, yeah, wh why does Shy Guy Ghost quack like a duck? You're not a duck, no, don't you dare punch me in the... Um, I just told you not to punch me in the face. And what did you do? What did you do, guys? Did, did you see what he did? Even though I specifically told him not to do it, what did he do? He punched me in the face, that's it. You know, your friend is gonna go too, you know. All of you shall be punished! Don't you dare spear me with that... I was about to say spear me with that spork. Uh, so yeah, spear me with that spork. But... <gasps> it's the last remaining candle, guys. <laughs> I was about to say mesmerise it, but um, that shy guy goes doesn't want us to mesmerise it. You douchebag, how dare... <gasps> no! The candles! How could this be? The last candle! I shall avenge this candle! How dare you! You douches get inside the hoover! Get in there right now! Oh, this is the most tragic no 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 I can't see I can't see get off me you freaking get in here please go on go away just go away thank you right you you may be my favourite colour, but I will not forgive you or your friends for putting up that little candle. Mm, even though it's technically me, but I have to suck you up, so technically it's your fault, because if I never suck you up, then I would have to suck up the candle. <laughs> Whoa, how far did I say that? I swear my voice is getting faster and faster for every episode. In fact, I'm talking really fast right now. Oh my goodness. I hope that's not a problem for you guys. Can you understand what I'm saying? I'm so sorry, but I've always been a fast speaker. But, you know, Chugga Conroy does it. He speaks pretty quickly. I'm not trying to be like him at all, I'm just using him as an example. Get back here, please. So yeah, if it's... Please tell me if it's annoying, because I swear I'm not doing it on purpose. It's just... I've always been like this. What the fr Why are you not going down? Excuse me. What the... Uh... 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 Okay. Well. He went in here, apparently. Okay, which way do I go to get in there? Uh, the door. <laughs> Ceiling surprise! I was about to call them fish, those aren't fish. Where wrong at? No. I went the wrong way, I went the wrong way, I went the wrong way. I tripped over a mouse, I tripped over a mouse. I'm not very good at this game. Now, how do I get in? How do I get in? Just a minute. It went to the anteroom! 
or anti room. I don't know how to pronounce this thing. Ugh. I swear, I swear, oh, yeah. if you go through that wall again, I am going to knock you silly. And you will not like to be knocked silly by a British female. Damn it! Oh, it's in Nana's room. Okay, gotcha. Right, where are you? It flashed over here, I think. Please just get inside the Hoover boon, boon swoggle. What a stupid name that is. Come back here. Come on. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you. Thank Lordy. Thank the Lord. Arceus Piku. Okay. Whew. Oh, we can go on to the next part, can't we? Okay, the next part. I'd recommend not looking at my life. Well, I don't know why I point that out. Anyway, uh, the, 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 mind the mice, mind the mice. Well, Super Mario 64 now. Super Mario 64. I know it's the wrong song, but I don't care. Okay. Now, I recommend getting ice. Because you need ice. So technically it's not a recommendation, it's a necessity. But in my practice recording when I did this, money came out of ha! Okay. Apparently I forgot it. Wait. I forgot to catch the boo in here. Wait, no, I didn't forget to catch it. It's just because I couldn't catch it because it ran away from me. Right, okay, let me get this boo first. Oh! Okay, I thought that was it for a second. I was like, wait a minute, I'm not ready for you yet. Table blanket, tablecloth out without knocking anything off the table. I've never met anyone who can do it, but I know people. I don't want to go up there. I know people can do it, so very impressive, actually. Oh, yeah. admit, whoop. Just how did someone find out they could do it? Like, what makes you think just to pull something? Like, was it by accident or they do it on purpose to see if they could? I don't know. I don't know. If anyone knows the history of this, please tell me. Anyway, go into the table. Here it comes. Oh, it's in the box. Boojang, this, oh yeah, I did try to catch him, but he got away, didn't he? So, right, let's get him back. Let's get him back. Okay, I'm a sheep, apparently. Boom. Okay, let's go on to the next bit. And thank you. Uh, I still, I still miss, profess, mess up. <laughs> Words are not coming out of my mouth the way I want them to. I still mess up Dr. Egad and Professor Egad all the time with his name. I don't know why. Sometimes I call him Dr. Egad, sometimes I call him Professor Egad. And even though I don't think he's a doctor because, you know, well, there's a Dr. Mario game and I've never actually played Dr. Mario. No, in the comments, tell me. Actually, oh, wait, wait, wait. I had an idea, all right? I'm watching Kip Section, Kip Section and Gizzy Gaza doing um uh, Sky Lucky Pandora Box Survivor. Oh, I don't remember what it's called. I'll write on the screen what it is. And apparently YouTube dis statistics say that people stop watching a YouTube video after two minutes. So to prove them wrong, they do a hashtag after every video. So I want to do the same thing. So if you watch it at this point, hashtag down below, Dr. Mario. Do it. Then I'll know that you're watching this video. Ha -ha. If you don't write it and you say you've watched it, then I won't believe you because you didn't write Dr. Mario into the comments. So right now, do it, do it. Do it do, don't stop. Just stop what, yeah, stop whatever you're doing. Put down your fork. Stop eating your pizza or your pasta. Stop drinking your Pepsi or your lemonade or whatever. Right, Dr. Mario. Into the safari. Okay, story time. Uh, Every time, before I start playing an episode of Luigi's Mansion, I'll do a practice recording. But sometimes I do more in the practice recording than I do in the actual episode because, you know, sometimes things happen and, um, like me failing at, um, slim bank shot and so I was unable to do some things. So when I did the practice recording today, I did not do what I'm supposed to do right here. So, and because I haven't recorded for a fortnight, I completely forgot. <laughs> Onwards we go. Okay, now I don't think there's any money in here because I didn't- I remember not getting any- Never mind! Ignore me, guys. Just ignore me. Actually, don't ignore me. I need- I need- I want my viewers. Don't leave me. Please don't leave me. I need you. Okay, press A on this telescope. And... Stars in their multitude Scarce to be counted Fill in the darkness with order and light. Okay.
Okay, I'm done. And this magically makes the wall disappear into a space, guys. And this is what you do. You catch a shooting star. You aim it, which I'm not very good at. At the moon. See, I told you I'm not very good at this. You aim it. You're meant to hit the moon with it, basically. Uh, I'll cut to when I do it. What? How did that miss? How did that? How did you miss? It was three feet from you. Oh, I thought he was going to miss by like a freaking fraction again. And we just blew up the moon. No, it wasn't Dr. Eggman that blew up the moon. Oh, no, no, no. It was Luigi. Luigi, you twit. Anyway, let's go and get this star, shall we? How long? Uh, I don't think I'll be able to do all I wanted to do. Oh, will I be able to do it? I don't know. Uh, well, let me pick up this star and I'll think about it. All right, let me get this star. Boink. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. You found Mario Star. What a glittering beauty. <laughs> okay, I'm going to cut to Madame Clairvoy's house. Everyone just listen to this music for just a moment and appreciate its beauty. Okay, you're done. Now time to experience Madame Clairvoy's last voice change. Hmm, what is this object you have here? Show it please to Madame Clairvoy. What is this? If it is a if it is a Mario star, oop! Knock the table. Sorry. What otherworldly? Oh God! What otherworldly beauty? I can't speak. Apparently, it just shows I haven't done this so long. Oh, they come now. The spirits come. Come spirits of power. Come spirits of sight. Show to me the all things occurring here tonight. Crystal orb, symbol of my clan. Use your darkling power to show us all you could have been can. Show us all you can. Show us this Mario. See, I said this so many times. I just you know. The light of the spirits comes. Show us what we seek. Okay, we'll stop doing that now. Ah, the spirits return to me. I see, I see, I see your dear Mario. The scene appears before me. What is this? Bowser? How could this be? I see the hideous form of Bowser. Is Bowser somewhere in this mansion? I cannot believe it. And yet, I see it. I thought as Mario had soundly defeated Bowser. Okay, um, yeah, Madame Clairvoyer, uh, yeah, Mario defeated Bowser many times, but Bowser rises from the freaking volcano after being burnt alive, so I don't think getting jumped on a few times is going to stop him. Has King Boo somehow re revived Bowser? This could be horrible. Wait, is Bowser a ghost in all the other games now after this? Well, for you. Thanks, Madam Clairvoyer. Ugh. Oh, no. The powers leave me. The spirits depart. This is all I can show you, Luigi. That was the last of my power. Good thing we had just enough items then, huh? But I have given words to... Okay, what kind of person carries a star in their pocket? Doesn't it burn it out or something? I've got a rocket in my pocket. Okay, I hate that rhyme. <laughs> Don't ask why. But I have given words to what the spirits have shown so I can return to my painting satisfied. Send me there now. Your va you vacuum-wielding rogue. Ah, oh, finally, I can return in peace to my painting. Sweet happiness in oils. Thank you, Luigi. I thank you, kind Luigi. Okay, Madame Clever is actually really extremely easy to catch because, you know, she actually voluntarily wants to go into the painting, so she doesn't really struggle at all. So all you need to do is just lean against the wall or a candlestick in my case, and hopefully don't get hit by the mushrooms. Don't... Okay, he's bounced away from me, that's good. And things are fine. Yeah, like I said, look, she's not even struggling. Although the thing is, she has actually not... I like to say she's not even struggling that much, but she still is struggling. Like, I thought you want to go in your painting, wouldn't you just stand still and just let it go straight... let yourself go straight in, straight away? But, okay, and I've got to say this, Madame Thor has nice hair. Beautiful. No, no. <laughs> that was close. And then now we have the key. And, uh... Oh, God, I've been recording for 19 minutes. Oh, should I... You know what, because I haven't recorded for a while, I'm going to make this a little long episode because... Well, I haven't recorded for a while, and I want to try and catch up on my freaking uh, <laughs> practice recordings so I don't get confused anymore. So I'll see you back to where I was supposed to go. You know, the door I was supposed to go through. Hey! Oh yeah, I never mentioned these things yet. These are sparks, by the way, and they do this. Yeah, they blow up. Are they meant to be dead fuzzies or some things? They kind of look like dead fuzzies. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, I was going to show you one, but it decided to blow me up. Or Luigi up. Alright then, fine. I won't give you any more screen time. Screw you guys. <laughs> and now we can go through this door. Okay, now according to my strategy guide, this is the last golden mouse. Let's catch it. 
Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. Why can't I turn it off? The gear again. Zip, zip, zip. My controller went weird. Okay. My controller went weird. I was, I meant I was hitting the wrong button. I'll, I'll just admit it. I was a fool. I'm sorry. But yeah, make sure you have the ice element in here. Oh, yeah. And also, make sure if you have low life to go in this box because it always gives you that heart. I love this box. This box in me. We're good friends. Anyway, let's just blow in every dirt. There we go. Here we go. Now, ice you. Waiting for him to thaw. Oh my god, what the? What the hell just. Um. Okay, uh, I don't know what just happened there. Uh. Well, okay. Well, anyway, I got him. I don't care. He's mine. Now, the next one should appear any moment. There you are. I right, freeze you. Wait for him to thaw. And. Okay, I won't boom then. How dare he stop me from boom? My goodness gracious me! No, you're, you're not supposed to boom, don't you dare boom! Ha 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 Okay, now this part is annoying. You'll find out why in just a moment. Okay, see? Elemental ghost and garbage can ghost. I'd recommend catching the um water element ghost first. And not sipping over a bit. How did I not lose any life on that? Wow, okay, that was lucky. Okay, catch him first. Try and avoid them as best as you can. All right, I think I've done it. Yes, okay. And this is what I do for the garbage can ghosts. Okay, I will show you in just a moment. Okay, one. Get them into a corner. All right, um, suck up the bananas first. Okay, try this again. Okay, try and get them into a corner. Then they can't hit you with their dang bananas. Okay, tr tr I'm not doing very well at this. Oh my god. Okay, then there's one. And the last one. What the heck did I walk onto that? In the dang thing. Okay, here we go in the corner. Right. Yeah, that's how I did the practice recording. It went a lot better than this. Okay. Get inside. Come on, 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 come on. Boom. Okay, now before this episode ends, let's find this boot, shall we? I'll just pick up all these banana skins before Luigi falls and hurts himself again. Oh, wait, this key. I won't forget to pick it up this time. Boink. And the room I will show you next episode. Because I actually hit the button without realising it. Sorry, guys. No bomb. Little boopy. Ow. Oh, little, little boop. Bo Peep is cute. You're just annoying. Don't you dare go in that room. Don't you dare. No, 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 no. That's it. Good boy. Thank you. Excellent. Because I can't go in that room yet. Okay, let's see if I can get him. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I can do this. Come on, 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 come on. Please, 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 please. Oh, yes. I did it. Uh, what's he saying? You've seen some small ghosts other than Boos, haven't you? Well, I'm pretty sure they're ghosts freed from the... I think you've already said this. I could have sworn he already said this. Uh, if he hadn't, well, uh... I don't remember, but I swear he's already said this. Anyway, guys, uh... Thank you for watching and for existing. This has been Luigi's Mansion episode 13. I'm sure it's 13. In the next episode, we'll be going to the next room along this... Along this... Corridor. No, not this room. That one. I'm sure it's that one. Yep, it's that one. Okay. Bye, guys!